Hello, in this tutorial, we are going to look at how we can create and save a simple PowerPoint presentation. We are going to use the current Microsoft PowerPoint version, which comes with the current Windows 10 installation package. So to get started, let's go to the start button, then we can browse and look for powerpoint or uh, better still we can search using the search bar here just type powerpoint then you launch the application so this is the interface of the current microsoft powerpoint So you can use this one too to look at other templates that you could have chosen. You can choose any of these templates and start working with them. For the purpose of our tutorial, we will be using the blank presentation. So let's click here. So we can see that the interface of the current version of Microsoft PowerPoint is almost similar to that of Microsoft PowerPoint 2013 version, 2016 version, 2019, 2010. They are almost the same. So over here we see the quick access toolbar. And on the quick access toolbar, you can see the save button. You can also see the start presentation or start slideshow from the first slide button here. We can customize it. So we can add other buttons or other commands here by checking those commands in the drop down list here now currently we can see that in the name of this presentation is presentation one by default they want to give us the name we want so to do that we can click this button here or you use the keyboard shortcut control plus s so I'm clicking this so I can save my presentation with the name in this current folder. This is online folder. That is the OneDrive folder. But I want to choose a location on my desktop. So I'll browse by clicking more options then I'll Browse here and go to my desktop. Then I will save it here. So, better still, you can also create a new folder inside this document and save it by just clicking new folder. So the name that I want to use is so you then click save to save document so you can see that the name has been updated from presentation one to saving a presentation in microsoft powerpoint you could also access the save button by clicking file then you click the save over here now if this name is not what you want or you want to modify it you can just 
click save as then you browse to that location so currently this is our location so save us so saving a presentation so if i want to modify it i modify then i click save but note that you can save the same file with two names so if i click the if i save this now it's going to create a duplicate of this file and you can see that currently that is the name that has been updated and if you go to the folder if you go to that folder you see the two files here Good. now another way of renaming it is make sh making sure that you close the file here so making sure that you close this file then you can right click here and rename your file by typing any name you want over here Good. Now, there's also another way you could even start a presentation by first creating a name before launching the PowerPoint application. So, let's say I want to create a Microsoft PowerPoint file, Microsoft PowerPoint presentation in a folder within this folder. So what I can do is I can create new folder here. Good. Then I can right click here, go to new, then choose Microsoft PowerPoint presentation. Then I'll give it a name. then you press enter on the keyboard so now if i open this presentation it will open powerpoint and we see that it comes with a name now in order to start with this presentation you have to click over here so when you click here you see that it has created a presentation for us just like how we go to the start button search for microsoft powerpoint launch it before saving it we can also use the alternative to create a presentation and save it good so as you are working with powerpoint you have to keep saving it by pressing this button or using ctrl plus s